Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Recently, we have made a detailed video on DRDO's multi-mission maritime aircraft Triple MA based on C295 platform. In the video, we have covered in detail about the sensors, electronics and avionics going to be used in the platform for maritime operational roles. The aircraft is also well suited to conduct maritime patrol, anti-submarine warfare and anti-surface warfare missions. The aircraft has underwing hardpoints for carrying weapon system as well as reconnaissance, jamming ports and searchlights. The C-295 has up to six underwing hardpoints for weapon systems. The hardpoints can hold torpedoes, anti-surface missile, mines and depth charges. In May 2010, Airbus military conducted the first torpedo launch from a C-295 MPA aircraft. In July 2010, the anti-submarine variant was certified by Spanish authority INTA for its military airworthiness. In the anti-submarine warfare role, the C-295 can also be equipped with MK-46 torpedoes. The MK-46 is backbone of United States Navy's lightweight anti-submarine warfare torpedo inventory. It has an operational range of 11 km and maximum speed of 40 knots or 74 km per hour with a warhead of 43.9 kg. Alternatively, C-295 can also be armed with MK-54 lightweight torpedoes. In an anti-ship role, the C-295 can be integrated with two Marte MK-2 as anti-ship inert missile installed under the wing. Airbus military and MBDA have successfully completed the first flight of the C-295 maritime patrol aircraft with an instrumented Marte MK-2S anti-ship inert missile installed under the wing. The MBDA Marte MK-2S missile is a fire and forget all-weather medium-range sea scheming anti-ship weapon system equipped with inertial mid-course guidance and radar homing terminal guidance and capable of destroying small vessels and heavy damaging major vessels. The missile has a weight of 310 kgs and is 3.85 meters long. The C-295 aircraft is equipped with self-protection equipments including cockpit armor, a radar warning receiver, a missile approach warning system, and a laser warning receiver. The aircraft can fire chaff and flares to deceive the incoming radar directed anti-aircraft artillery, radar command guided missiles, radar homing guided missiles, and infrared guided missiles. Back in November 2021, Airbus and BEL has signed an agreement worth $93.1 million for the supply of radar warning receiver and ultraviolet missile approach warning system developed by DRDO. It was part of the offset clause of Tata Airbus project for 56 twin turboprop C-295 medium transport aircraft worth Rs 20,000 crore for Indian Air Force. DRDO's ultraviolet based missile approach warning system will be installed on all Airbus C-295 bought by Indian Air Force and same might be deployed on the C-295 Triple MA along with EOIR sensors. The C-295 can fly at a maximum speed of 480 km per hour with flight altitude of 7,620 meters during normal operation. It has maximum takeoff weight of 23,200 kgs. The aircraft has an endurance of more than 11 hours and range between 1,555 km to 2,148 km depending upon the payload and fuel combination it carries. Though it has less endurance and power when compared to PATIs, still it's good for tactical missions while PATIs can be deployed on missions which demands higher endurance capability. 
At a price almost one fourth of peer ties, the triple MA based on C295 is cheap, viable, and very potent platform for Indian Navy. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.